morning and welcome to this morning's math session. As usual, we're going to start with fluent five. Today's session is going to be finishing off multiplication and division, looking at short division. As with normal, pause the video, have a go at the fluent five, and then we'll go through it together. Cool. So hopefully you've had a go at the fluent five now, so let's go through and see if you've got the right answers. First one, 76 times four. Hopefully you laid it out like that. Starting with six times four is 24. 7 times 4 is 28, add 2 is 30. Hopefully you should have had the answer, 304. Second one, 83 times 7. 3 times 7 is 21. 8 times 7 is 56, add 2 is 58. 581. Number 3, 124 times 4. 4 times 4 is 16, 2 times 4 is 8, add the 1 is 9, 1, 10, I should say, not 1, and 1 times 4 is 4, 496. Number 4, 372 times 8, 8 times 2 is 16, 7 times 8 is 56, add 1 is 57, 3 times 8 is 18, Add 5, 24. 24, put me on the spot there. The answer is 2,400. Add 5. Ah! No! 29. Don't do that, it's 29. <laughs> Crikey, what sort of person makes a mistake like that? Uh, right, last one. One who's videoing. <laughs> My brother's the disagreement. <laughs> Send help, year 6. Send help. <laughs> right, 94 times 9. 9 times 4 is 36. 9 times 9 is 81, which you add 3 to, and you get 84. There we go. Yay! We made it. We made it through. <laughs> okay, so after that professional and slip performance, we're now going to talk you through the problems. Again, don't panic. Read them carefully. Read it more than once and underline any key information. So, problem number one. A car park has 230 rows of 17 spaces. There are 1,250 cars already parked. How many empty spaces are there? Obviously, you've got to think about this. It's not going to be a one-step problem. So read it through very carefully, thinking about what you need to work out. After that, you've got Mr. Smith has tiled his kitchen floor. He's got 25 tiles that way, 25 tiles that way. Each tile costs 18p. How much does the floor cost in total? So again, think about the steps you have to take. Pause, remember to pause the video between them and have a go at working them out. Finally, number seven, Rosie does 37 sit-ups every day for a year. Annie does 370 sit-ups every day in July. Who does more sit-ups and by how many? Remember, if you can't remember the days of the month, then put your fists together and count on your knuckles or the, the bits in between. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, etc. Good luck. 